So Peter, he doesn't deny hardship. He went through it himself, but he says it's an opportunity for faith to grow. It's, this is an opportunity for you and I to be strengthened in our faith. He says this in verse seven. Trials, they're gonna show that your faith is genuine. Say this with me, what? It is being tested. It is being tested as fire tests and purifies gold. Though, though your faith is more precious than mere gold, nothing is more valuable than your faith. Your family is not more valuable. Your work is not more valuable. Your, your education is not more valuable. Your health is not more valuable. Nothing is more valuable and more precious, and nothing should you guard more than your faith. I'd, I'd like for you to write this down. You've got to fight for your faith. Faith isn't just gonna come. It's not just gonna be like, bing, I got it, I'm good. Whoa, check me out, whoop, whoop. No, no, you, you've gotta fight for your faith. If there's going to be victory, there can be no victory without a fight. And Peter says that faith is tested by fire. In, in other words, it's, it's unpleasant, it, it's painful, but fire, it brings impurities to the surface. And I believe that God uses adversity. He's using this time right now to bring some of the impurities to the surface so that he can scoop out those impurities and remove them from you so that you can be strengthened. I mean, this is, this is listen, you, you gotta get the ugly out. I don't know no other way to say it. You gotta get the ugly out. And I think, Ugly is how a lot of people are acting right now. Can we not all agree on that? Light up the chat and say, yeah, give a thumbs up on that one. I mean, it's crazy right now the way people are acting. There is a lot of ugly out there, whether it's, it's the politics, the pandemic. I, I, was, I was talking to a barista at one of my favorite coffee shops, and they were telling me that somebody got so ticked off, they stormed out of the coffee shop and spit on the door. True story, spit on the door. I said, what in the world? You gotta be kidding me. Why did they spit on the door? <laughs> and they said it was all about a mask. All over the mask. Because they were gonna make them put their mask on. And they got frustrated and they, and they stormed out. And I think when this happens, we're, and we see this everywhere. You see it on social media. You, you hear it in the workplace. I mean, you, you, you just get... Thanksgiving's coming, and some of us are like, oh, good, there's going to be a lockdown. They're telling us not to get together for Thanksgiving. That is an answer to prayer. I have been praying for that to not happen because you know what's going to happen. Your family's going to get together, and it's going to be pretty heated over the politics. I mean, it's just, it can be very, very ugly. So why are people acting like this? I think it's because pressure is a good revealer. Pressure is a good revealer. In Matthew chapter 7, Jesus says this, bad trees produce bad fruit, good trees produce good fruit. That's it. And in other words, whatever is in you, when you get squeezed, is going to come out of you. 